Girls Go Cyber Start is a program made to encourage young ladies in grades 9 through 12 to get involved with cybersecurity. It is taking cybersecurity initiatives or, or normal practices and turning it into a game. So that makes it fun and interesting and lets students at least see if that's something they want to go into. They can go register as an individual or they can register as a team. And once they register, I think they have until March the 5th, and they will get access to a website and they can do it at home, at school, they just need a computer and internet access. And they go and they get points. And as they build points, they compete in higher and higher levels for bigger prizes. This one in particular has that gamification component to it where it's designed to be a challenge um, based Per, um, competition. So it, it pre uh, presents you a scenario and you get challenges. Um, you, you try to solve those challenges. There are ways to get additional help um, and tips within it so that uh, if you get stuck there's still a way to, to progress forward and, and, make, and get those achievements. Last year some of our students won MacBooks. They have scholarships available. They have um, if so many girls participate at a school they win the right for the whole school to access the the game and to play this cyber challenge. When you think of cyber security, um, and maybe I'm aging myself here, but a lot of people might picture the matrix screen of the green characters raining down and thinking I can't do that, but that's not actually what the job is. Um, everything you do today, whether you're driving to the store, you're at the store, you um, go to the doctor's office, you go to a government agency to do some services, it's all being operated by technology. And that technology um, with it comes risk and needs to be protected. And so uh, this is a growing industry that's going to, that it's likely just to con continue to grow. And it's an opportunity that I think a lot of people sell themselves short because they just don't have the information about what it really entails and this uh, program here is a great opportunity to, to get that exposure. Unfortunately, there's a lot of young ladies that haven't really shown interest in the IT field and that's, you know, that's a downfall. We, we have the programs here in the state. All of our colleges are starting to put out cybersecurity programs and that's something we need to encourage our students because, you know, it's an up-and-coming industry. There's jobs available, you know. We have plenty of jobs available in that field. And so if we can move more of our students into those, those areas, it'll benefit the state and the students. Last year we had 230 participants across the state and we'd really like to see that number increase this year. There was 27 high schools um, that competed, um, but only 230 students. So we really want to see those numbers jump because we know the West Virginia students can do it.